Black shade, Jenny K, diamonds go parade. Jenny, Mola, roller in the kitchen, whipping Sonya. Whip my blood, look like Packy, y'all. 28 grand, I'm cooking a zip. Pull up in a white form, whip. I'm whipping the brick. Slicker than Rick, got your main bitch on my dick. Yo, it's your boy Eam, back with the first fucking vlog. First vlog, oh, I told myself I wasn't going to use foul language like that. You know, my mom watched my videos, you know what I'm saying? Support me, you, know, you feel me? But this is my first vlog slash sneaker review. This is going to be a sneaker review for real, for real. I mean, because that's what I'm going to do on some occasions, what I'm going to do. You know what I'm saying? But um, a lot of people think it's going to be about the gammas because, you know, nah, nah. Not yet. I'll I'll wait a little bit for that, but um, keep out the way. But yes, him him is a sneakerhead. Like I don't have all the fucking shoes. No, I don't. But my love for shoes still stands, and that's what the fucking sneakerhead is. Knowledge on shoes, a lot of it. Period. You know what I'm saying? Even eat, eat my car keys. You know what I'm saying? Keep this on my car keys at all times. You know what I'm saying? Always have that shit. You know what I'm saying? But let's get down with it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it's going to be on the Fighter Jets, Airphone Positive One, Fighter Jets. You know what I'm saying? And for all you sneakerheads out there, for official people, I got to put the style code and everything else so y'all know they legit and shit. Here's the fucking box, as you see. Right there, Foot Locker. It's our 11 and a half Airphone Positive One. Yeah, right, right there. Now, let's get down to the actual fucking shoes. Put these out here. Put the fucking box and shit. And here's the fucking shoe. Right here. The reason why I'm doing this is because I feel like this is one of the most underrated releases of last year. Period. Point blank. I think it was. For the detail that they put in, they put a lot more detail than they put in a lot of other shoes. You know what I'm saying? With, with different things. And basically, I'm going to run you through the shoe. You got translucent solo course. Mine's a little bit yellow. A little bit. You know what I'm saying? They've been worn. A lot bought them from somebody, you know what I'm saying? Like, you don't always have to buy them the day of the release or a flight club. Flight club is the most over fucking priced place to buy shoes. Period. Point blank. That that's what it is. Just because their name is Flight Club, the price goes up like two hundred dollars. Period. I'm I'm a fan of them because that's the only place you can go that you know for a fact they're gonna be legit and they're dead stock. Nobody's worn them. Period. But here we go. Like this is left shoe, of course. You know what I'm saying? They got the penny logo on the back. Lightning bolt right here in the pull tab. Lightning bolt also on the front pull tab as well. They got the red penny logo. And this is the way I wear my strings in my phones. They're re they're real loose. I'm on the like so you can see them. Right there, loose. That's just the way I feel they look best. I don't like them laced up. They look fucking ugly to me when they're laced up. I fuck with them loose and shit because they're still gonna fit right because of the mesh you know what i'm saying the mesh is not gonna let your foot all flat around and shit you know what i'm saying it's gonna keep it in place for real and um the best part about it to me is no i'm gonna get the soles in a minute but they also have right here on if you read that danger right there and on the inside no step fuck with that like that that shit is love you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I fuck with that little detail right there. You know what I'm saying? And that shit is sweet to me. Now, you also have the carbon fiber plate, red and black. That's good. I Not not many phones have, have the different color carbon fiber plates. You know what I'm saying? An easy way to tell if they're not legit or not, check the carbon fiber, dog. Because if it doesn't have that, if it doesn't have that rough feel to it, you know what I'm saying? If it just feels like it's plastic, no bueno, cuz. No bueno. You know what I'm saying? That's not, and I do not like the fact that souls get yellow, you know what I'm saying? But there's literally nothing, and I mean nothing, you can do to keep your souls from getting yellow. Nothing at all, son. Like, no matter what you do, you can keep them in the box. You can keep them in the box, never put them on feet, nothing. They're still going to turn yellow eventually. It's completely, what's the word? Inevitable. It's inevitable, dog, for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, because the way, the reason why souls turn yellow, oxidation. 
oxygen hits the rubber in here, the translucent, and it turns it yellow just for aging, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You can't really tell how yellow they really are, but they're really not actually too yellow. You tell them, like, the main points is down here. Right here, they're starting to turn a little bit yellow. A little bit down here. And, my, and these were released in 2013, I believe. I'm, I'm not really too sure. You know what I'm saying? I forgot. I'm doing a video. I can't really take time to look it up because I forgot. This is a spur moment thing. I need a vlog to put out there. You know what I'm saying? I, I told y'all I was going to do vlogs, so I'm not going to just make a whole other channel and not uh, upload to it. I'm saying this is the right shoe. Now, now the one thing I love about this shoe is it comes with the dog tags. Let me test. Oh, you know what I'm saying. So, and it cut, and the dog tags come with the penny logo on this side right there. You know what I'm saying, and it comes with writing right here. I'm not gonna be able to read that probably, but I'll read it out to you. And friends, Hardaway number one. 7-13-1971, Memphis, Tennessee, Nike Phone Positive 1. Right there. I was saying, uh, everything's the same on the right shoe. So there's no step right here. Except this one on the right shoe, you know what I'm saying? It's still the same, the danger right there, of course. And the no step right there. You know what I'm saying? Maybe this one you can see a little more yellow on it. Yeah, you can see because I walk... This way I walk on my right foot, you know what I'm saying? I walk on the right side of my heel. You know what I'm saying? A little bit. They're right there because I, I stepped in some dirt yesterday. You know what I'm saying? I was in not not really a good area. You know what I'm saying? So, um, it, I mean, the sun's are yellow right there a little more than everywhere else. But the sides, like, when they're on feet, these right here, well, it's like my pair because they've they been worn that much. They've been worn for You cannot tell that they're yellow, for, like, on feet, when you look down on the sides, they're still icy. You can still see kind of blue right here from where they're like they were still icy. Now, people always say, "Oh, you should ice your shoes, get them back." Uh, the only way you do is put it in the sun. That's not fucking true, dog. That's bullshit. That's me mad. But, but um, it's not. It, it's not. It's not true at all because you can dye them back blue, factory blue, like. I can dye these back better than, better than factory blue, pretty much. You know what I'm saying? I, I can dye back pretty much the same way they came, but the way people know me, ice them, they get they they get sea glow, which makes sure I think it's um, hydrogen peroxide or some other stupid shit. You know what I'm saying? And then they sit them out there in the sun. The only bad part about sitting them out there in the sun is, is that that melts the glue that that's right here that keeps the sole to the actual missile. You know what I'm saying? It, so basically, if you if you went under the sun and it melts the glue, that's what caused soul separation. That's why you see so many 11s, you know what I'm saying? Like 11s, 6s, uh, what else? 11s, 6s, I forgot what else has the icy soul. I'm not thinking right right now. You know what I'm saying? Um, mainly the 6s and 11s, they have the they have soul separation because people have tried to ice them. And it, and it left them out there in the sun and it fucking melts the glue. And then you can't do anything right after that like i mean you have to worry about super glue and this shit which is not gonna it's never gonna be back to the way it was ever now now i thought about that so the best part about these shoes to me is the fucking soul that's that i love the insoles and shoes now my soles are always gonna be good in my shoes because especially my phones i never wear the soles in my phones ever because to me your foot is directly on the airbag this this sole, it's a it's it's cushion, but it's in between your foot and the airbag. So basically, they they fit so much more comfortable if you take the soles out. These also they're eleven and a half. In foams, I wear a twelve. I could not find these. I've searched for a long time been trying to find these shoes in my size size twelve. Could not find them for the right price. And that's also what they want to talk about. That's the main thing in in the shoe game is patience. If you don't get a day release. Do not go out there and try to pay some astronomical price for a reseller to pay fucking four hundred dollars for these shits. Don't don't do it. Like me, I got a friend. He's 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 a fucking sneakerhead too. He lives out here with me. You know what I'm saying? By the way, I'm in North Carolina. I'm not in uh DC, Maryland, Virginia. I'm not up there anymore. I've lived there for like a year now. People keep asking me about from DC. I'm not. I just talk like I'm from there because you know I spend most of my time there. You know what I'm saying? But. 
he's like, I can't I can't really say who he is, you know what I'm saying? Due to different things, but I go to him a lot. I used to go to him a lot, you know what I'm saying? So um the best part about these soles is I feel it in the right shoe. And you see right here, danger up top, danger on the sides, ejector seat. I fuck with that. Like I really fuck with that shit. That shit's sweet to me. I'm like I, I I love I love inner designs of soles. I like it whenever I like whenever shoes get into like the designing of them, design of soles better. I love that shit. It really makes the shoe pop to me. You know what I'm saying? And I also don't want to wear my soles because one day I keep my shoes fresh. Like I keep them looking right. Like the bottoms might get the bottoms might get yellow, but that's not a problem because soon I'll be getting my sea glow and my rit dye, and that's pretty much all it takes to turn your soles back blue the way they were when they came. Rit dye, um, Q-tips, wet rag, and sea glow. Sea glow you can buy it on Amazon for like twelve dollars. I think it's for like four ounces, and four ounces can ice like five shoes. Well, five pairs of shoes. You know what I'm saying? Ten shoes. But also on the Left hand, Twitter, fuck it. Uh, on the left hand side, they have the little Air Force symbol. It's not really too much, but it's still the fact that, you know what I'm saying, both souls are different. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with that. Both souls, shit, drop that motherfucker. Uh, both souls are, in fact, different. Right there. Fuck with that shit. You know what I'm saying? And also the style code, just in case anybody that doesn't, doesn't uh, do that shit. Where the fuck is the style code at? Uh, shit. Oh yeah, suggested retail. These were fucking two thirty five. Just these are two thirty five when they dropped. Now phones are two fifty. Like phones used to be just like they should probably just like Jays, but then people started hyping them up, and it turned them all to fucking now they're hype shoes. But now now they're called the Doughboy shoes. You know what I'm saying? Because mainly because pretty much you gotta be either trapping or fucking got a good ass job to keep getting a crazy motherfuckers to that two fifty a piece. I know I'm not doing that shit, not because I don't have it, but just because like I'm not about to drop two fifty on the shoes and they come out like let's say over like think about that shit. If, if three pairs of foam drop in a fucking month, that's like seven hundred dollars. Like you could use that shit to save up and buy a pair of Yeezys or some shit. You know what I'm saying? That's like, not even worth it. And also, the dog tags did come in this little plastic zip zip bag, but I took them off because me. I like the flex normally, you know what I'm saying? I do. So we, I want, you know what I'm saying, the sound. These motherfuckers, when I, when I fucking take a step. I like that sound. I don't know, know where I am in all the time, you know what I'm saying? And here's the front look of the shoe. Right here. As you see the yellow one, every camera's not very towards the front. Left shoe, left side. Back, as you see both. Oh shit, I'm gonna drop these motherfuckers. You see, lightning bolts in the back. Tab on the side. I feel like the I feel like this is one of the most underrated shoes out there, you know what I'm saying? Like I fuck with them. I don't know why people really don't, you know what I'm saying? They, they say they're ugly. Don't give a fuck. I wear what the fuck I wanna wear. I don't wear shit that's hyped up. I wear shit that I fucking like. I'm into the whole military thing. If people don't know, my mother's a colonel in the army. I'm into the whole military thing. I'm looking for the green camos. I'm looking for those. I really want to give me a pair of those too. Like I really can't find them f for the right price. People still selling for like three hundred. Like I'm not about to pay that much. Not about to have it. Not about to pay that much for this shit because I don't. I don't feel like they're worth three hundred fucking dollars. Like phones to me should be sold for one sixty, just like every other fucking shoe. I understand that the foam in it might be fucking the same foam that they use for NASA, so the fuck what? Like, what, what, they make you a fucking astronaut because made by NASA? Fuck no. Yeah. Ah, too like that, bro. Too like that. But, people have seen on my Instagram, they saw when I first got them. I said new pickups and shit. Now, today is the, today is the 26th. Yeah, 26th, the Katie on Pearl drop tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? I'm probably drop tomorrow, and I do have my ticket. It's a raffle ticket, so there's no guarantee I'm going to get it. I have these, my, I have it right here, size 12, you know, size 12, as they wrote on the back. You know what I'm saying? This is just a regular ticket, you know what I'm saying? 
And as soon as I get those, before I even put them on feet, I'll probably do a review on those as soon as I get them. Um, yeah, that's it. And also, people have seen this hoodie on my Instagram, and everybody asked me, he, where did you get that hoodie? Where can I find it? The chance of you finding this hoodie anywhere, very fucking slim. This shit, they don't make this hoodie anymore. I know for a fact that they do not make it anymore. Now, people might have had it sitting around. They may be selling it. They've wearing, they worn it. But I got this hoodie. I was in Pennsylvania. I think I was 15. I'm 21 now. Yeah. I got this shit a long ass time ago. Long time ago. You know what I'm saying? So, and yes, it does zip all the way up as you've seen on my Instagram. Of course, I have the rosary on. You know what I'm saying? Gotta, gotta keep that shit on. This shit does zip all the way up. And people think it's a bait jacket? No. Why the fuck are I wearing a bait jacket? Ain't 2014. Get the fuck out of here. Sounds stupid. So yeah, it does zip all the way up. And yes, I still can see. You know what I'm saying? This right here. You can still see through this shit right here. You know what I'm saying? It also has the holes right here for the fucking thumb, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's sweet, you know what I'm saying? Like, some people think it's like Illuminati because of the fucking pyramids and shit. But nah, it's not. You know what I'm saying? This is a Volcom jacket. Not many people, you know what I'm saying, that are such my channel, like niggas, they don't really know about this shit. It's a skateboard brand. I mean, it's not, it's not really skateboard. It's skate, snow, surf. That's all they do. Volcom. Volcom Stone, that's the fucking brand. I love the fucking brand. I used to be a skater back when I was in high school, middle school. I still skate sometimes now if I feel like, you know what I'm saying, when I got older, you know what I'm saying, I got lazy, you don't feel like going out there and bust my ass all the time, you know what I'm saying? And skateboarding, you're going to fucking fall. Period, point blank, you're going to fucking fall, dog. If you was, oh my God, you're busting your ass. Like, you fall in basketball, you fall, you, you fall you on football, don't you? So, nigga, just a different time. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's, just, it's a little different setting. You know, the sun going down. So, I'm like, I'm, I look black as shit. I know. Fuck it. <laughs> but I still pull your bitch, though. But, um, I think that's pretty much it for this one. I got, you know what I'm saying? I still got a couple of shoes back there that I can review. The Gamma Simic, there, Obsidians, Thermals. Got my, uh, Summer Lakes. You know what I'm saying? So, pretty much, let me know which ones you want me to fucking, let me know which ones you want me to review next. I was like, let me know in the comments and shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, still got the Summer League LeBron, LeBron 9s. Fucking Moon Runway right there. You know what I'm saying? The game is right there on the box. You know what I'm saying? All that shit over there. I know we have them up there in my bed, but I just want to show you all that shit right there. I don't have them as you. Many. You know what I'm saying? I sold most collection about a year and a half ago. I sold most of my collection. I had vast. You know what I'm saying? I had it, but we need money, nigga. That shit happens. Now I'm starting to gain my shit back slowly. You know what I'm saying? Still a lot of shoes on my list. Like, I'm not going after the new shoes for real, for real. I'm going after more classic J's and foams. You know what I'm saying? Foams are a little harder to find for the right price, but J's, people kind of let them go for the low, like, under, like, sometime under under 200. You know what I'm saying? As you saw from my first, the the other vlog I did, <clears throat> I got my name to Bravos for, like, 220. You go on flight club, like, 300 times, 300, 400. You know what I'm saying? But, um, that's pretty much it, and um, that's one. This one thing I think that uh, Legend King, Terrell should do. I mean, retro game because they got a lot of Jade, but they got a bunch of the new shit that I don't have because I don't really go after the new shit. Because not saying he is, but most people who go after all the new shoes are hype beasts, and that is what I am not. Under no under no circumstances am I hype beast because I am a classic Jordan nigga because I, I grew up on Jays. You know what I'm saying like back before phones was popular. You know what I'm saying? I had the Black Toe 14s, the uh, Bread 13s, Bread 11s. I, I don't know I was a kid, you know what I'm saying? But I was little back then. I, I get all that shit, but um, um, if this is not uploaded by the 27th, New Heme City will be dropping on the 27th. If this is uploaded by then, if it is, disregard this. If it's not, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? But um, I think that's pretty much about it. I was, I was gonna wait till I did the review for the um, some of lakes, but I did go out and get these today. Puff socks, puff, purple. You know what I'm saying to match the uh, to match the some of lakes, and also I do plan on getting the Black History Month. I'm trying to find somebody who can get them. I mean, who can uh, sell them to me for a reasonable price, and once I do, I will I will get them. 
know what I'm saying? But I'm just waiting because I'm very patient on shoes. Like, I can wait forever, you know what I'm saying? Because shoes ain't going nowhere like unless somebody's wearing them. And like, people who buy shoes like that, they're not going to go out and get them beat. They're not going to. Like, you find maybe like 2% of them will. But most people who buy shoes like the Gammas, Black like History Month, you know what I'm saying, shit like that, they're not going to beat them up because they buy your shoes just like I do. I haven't even talked about the pack yet. I might break them out the pack tonight just to put them on and see how they fit. You know what I'm saying? But probably not going to. Probably wait, wait, wait till next time I wear them. Maybe probably next week. I don't know. I don't give a fuck. But first of all, let me let me know what y'all think about the series. I also will be doing other vlogs as well. But it's just I just feel like this was a good topic for me to do because um I just fuck with shoes. Like, I, it's my first love. Fuck with it. So until next time, people. Like I always say in every video. Adios.